Hi, welcome to Mark's English Academy, the place to learn English fast. In this lesson, I'm going to take you up the Pearl Tower here in Shanghai. So the building on the left here with the hole on top, that's sometimes called the bottle opener because uh, it looks like the thing you use to open a bottle of beer. And the building on the right, the tall one there, is called uh, the corkscrew, or some people call it the corkscrew because it looks like uh, the thing you use to open a bottle of wine. Actually, that building there is the second tallest building in the world. Some of my students have called this an elevator. It's not an elevator, it's an escalator. An elevator is the thing I'll be taking when I go up the, to the top of the Pearl Tower. Hello everyone, welcome to the Orange Pearl Tower, which is in the building of Shanghai. After 48 seconds, we are built up sphere, which is 263 meters high. The whole view of the whole rainbow will be right in front of you. I think you will like this beautiful city. Hope you have a good time. Thank you. So here I am at the top of the Pearl Tower in Shanghai. This is the view of the river and downtown. This area is the financial district. It's called Pudong. Should I trust Chinese glass? I guess it's too late. This is called a glass floor. And now I'm going down a different elevator. Okay, now I'm going to visit the Shanghai History Museum. It's at the base of the tower. You know, in a few hundred years, it's going to be really important to learn English. You'll be able to get a really good job, travel the world, make friends around the world. Hello ma'am, would you like to learn English? Hey, have you guys seen my videos? I have no idea what you guys are doing, but if you want to learn English, MarksEnglishAcademy.com How many sheep did you have to shear to get that wool? Hey, have you ever visited MarksEnglishAcademy.com? You know, learning English is better than doing drugs. Okay, this is awkward. Do you guys want to learn English? Would you like to sponsor one of my videos? It's cheaper than you think. I'll take a pint of your finest beer, please. Hey, great artwork, guys. Do you want to learn English? Mark's English Academy is the place to be. That's one hell of a beard you got there, sir. 
Hello, ladies. Would you like to learn some religious vocabulary in English? Instead of giving you money, I'll teach you English for half an hour. I'll teach you English if you give me a haircut. I'll teach you English if you teach me how to play that game. Hmm, if only these were in English, I could read them. Hey everyone, could I have your attention? Would you like to learn English? Please visit MarksEnglishAcademy.com You know, if you learned English, maybe you could escape from this cage. Hey, would you like to learn English? Excuse me, miss. Would you like to learn English? Hi everyone. You could be watching my videos while you drink tea. Hey, instead of dancing around a statue of a naked woman, you could be watching my videos online. Because you have such a nice beard, I'll teach you English for free. Hey, if you spoke English, that fire would be easier to light. Sir, you're doing a great job weaving those baskets. Would you like to learn English? Sir, if you had an iPhone, you could be watching my videos while you work. Sir, would you like to sponsor one of my videos? It'll help your business. I love your mustache. Hey kid, why did you shave half your head? You should get your dad to sponsor one of my videos. It'll help his business. That's some lovely fish you got there, sir. Would you like to learn English? You know, you could be watching my videos while you work. You know what's more fun than riding in a wheelbarrow? Learning English at Mark's English Academy. Cluck, cluck, cluck. Hello? Anybody home? Would you like to learn English? That's some very fine cloth you got there, gentlemen. Would you like to learn English? Instead of watching me heckle people about learning English, why don't you just become one of my students? I'll teach you really well. The word heckle means to keep bothering someone. I don't like to heckle people, but I love teaching people English.